Good morning guys, I just pulled up to work. It is Thursday morning, AKA the start of my four day weekend because I don't usually work Fridays and it's Memorial Day weekend so I don't work Monday either. <laughs> I thought I would do another full day of eating, surprise. This is like my 10th in a row, but you know. I started out my day, of course, with the venti iced coffee and this is just sugar-free vanilla and extra soy. So good, it's my go-to. I also got one of those spinach square foldovers from Starbucks, but of course, again, I ate it before I could show it to you. Because I had like a 30 minute drive to get here. I stayed at Natalie's house last night, so I ate it already, but imagine that you saw it. I'm about to go to work, another day in paradise, and today I thought I would do a vlog because I have just been in such a slump fitness wise. Pretty sure I haven't weighed myself in a couple days. I'd like just got my period TMI, I don't care, but I like was not in my best state. And uh, I just like felt like shh, crap. I don't know, maybe I'll weigh myself tomorrow. I have like deadlifts and cardio tonight because it's Thursday and I have three cardio sessions this week and I haven't done one yet. So Thursday, Friday, Saturday or something, I don't know. I'll be at the lake this weekend, so we'll see how that works. Okay, I'll see you guys at my next meal, bye. bye. So I am at work now, it is almost 11 a.m. and I am hungry, <laughs> surprise. So we have pharmaceutical reps bring us lunch a couple times a week and we oftentimes have leftovers, so right now I just heat it up. Yeah, I don't know if this is gross or not, but I just heated up a chicken breast from yesterday. They are so good. It is a rosemary herb chicken breast. And I'm just estimating this. This is what the size it is compared to my hand. But it's really good. Mm. Yum. I swear that if I had that chicken meal prepped for me, I would never not hit my protein macros. So good. Like sometimes chicken just grosses me out, but that chicken just tastes, tastes so good. Anyways, it is my lunch break. It is 12.30. I don't, I have like an hour for lunch, but I haven't been taking it like a full hour or maybe take 30 minutes and I'll go get something or I'll just hang out there at the office. But I mean, the more I work, I'm already here so I might as well get paid and work. So I'm gonna head over to 7-Eleven and get some really clean, healthy food. Health, yes, oh my God, yes. Hashtag healthy, hashtag clean eating, hashtag, um, hashtag, Eat clean, train dirty. Hi guys, so I got off of work a little early and I went and got my nails done. I've been like thinking about getting acrylics again. I've gotten them like five times and I always just go through phases where I want them and then I don't, so I got them again. And literally as I was walking out, I already like messed up some of the polish. This is why we can't have nice things, like why? I'm thinking I'm just gonna start getting gel polish because it lasts longer and it is a little more expensive, but then I don't get the opportunity to mess it up because it dries so fast. But I'm about to eat again. Um, I took home some of those chicken breasts from the Daily Grill. I weighed them cooked, so I have to calculate how much it is, like, not, like, raw, because I think the macros that are in there for the rosemary chicken on my fitness pal are for raw chicken, so I need to, like, do some calculations. And then I have 225 grams of cantaloupe and about two tablespoons of tzatziki. I'm just gonna hang out and watch some Netflix. I mean some YouTube. Whatever this is. Yes. Hi guys, you were probably expecting this next clip to be a food, seeing as this is a full day of eating, but I fell asleep at, at 6 p.m. No, not even, it wasn't even 6 yet, and I woke up at like 9.30. So there was no way I was even going to come close to hitting my macros and I was just like, I, I woke up at 9.30, my gym closes at 10 so I couldn't go lift but it kind of made me realize how I didn't want to lift and it's more than just, this has been going on for like quite some time, it's more than just like 
oh, I'm feeling lazy, like, it'll be good once you get there, because, like, once I'm there, I'm like, I don't want to be here, like, this does not make me feel good right now, and I think I'm just feeling a little burnt out from lifting, and it's really hard when you're cutting, because I think, like, to keep me motivated, I was like, okay, I'm, I'm gaining strength, like, or I'm building muscle, but when cutting it's kind of just like I'm just trying to hold on to everything that I have and I just wasn't I don't have like the energy for it and it could be irrelevant to cutting like who knows but it's just like happening at the same time and it's just a lot and yeah I think I might it's also hard when you like I'm being programmed to lift so I feel obligated to go even when I don't want to go and um I think I might, this is all just like my rambles, so who knows if this is actually what is going to happen, but I'm thinking I might just like take a little break from lifting. And it's weird because it's not like I'm I'm sitting here and I'm like, I never want to lift again. Like, I still love it. Like, I wish I was feeling it, but you know, it's a marathon and not a sprint and you go through ups and downs like with anything. And um, right now it's kind of a down. I'm thinking that I'm also just in a weird transition phase, like I'm home working for a month, five, six weeks before I move to San Jose and then I have to find a job there and get settled in. Like it's a weird transition phase where I'm not really like settled in anywhere either. I know that doesn't like make a difference, but, or it might not make a difference, who knows, but that's also kind of contributing to my weird mood, I guess. And um yeah, I don't know. Just thought I would let you guys know. This is irrelevant from a full day of eating. Yeah, and also this morning I weighed in. Well, I woke up at like 6 and I was 162.3 after consistently weighing in at 164 for the past like few days. And that just made me feel really bad about myself too. Which I know scale's just a number, but I obviously, I just started my period a couple days ago. So obviously it was something from... That I was just holding onto water and I was exper experiencing PMS really bad. So yeah, 162.3. And then... What was that? That was a weird sound. Anyways. Um, yeah, and then I went back to sleep and woke up later. Uh, a couple hours later. And I weighed in at 160.7, which actually ties my low weight in. Which is weird because... I just think it's weird. I've just been feeling so bad about myself lately. Yeah, I just thought I would like kind of ramble on a little bit and tell you guys what I'm feeling and what's going on because this is all part of the process. It'll all be okay and uh, yeah, just thought I'd let you guys know. Thanks for watching my half full day of eating. I will try to not be a potato next time and not fall asleep.